I was alone in my room, arranging my bedding on the night when everyone else had left for Kofu already. Footsteps... Bleh, footsteps creaked from the other side of my door. Huh? Whose footsteps could they have been? My curiosity began to get the better of me. I peeked my head out the door, and I walked down the hall in the direction of where I'd heard the footsteps. As I made my way outside of the compounds, I heard... Chifre, here. Heske quietly waved me over to join him, and I scurried over to hide where he had been sitting. Heske, what are you doing here? Not this music, please. Anything but this music. It's unsettling. Wait, so those footsteps I heard earlier were from the men in the Fury Corps? What's Sun and Sun up to? Does that mean they're acting independently? Like maybe he had nothing to do with this? どうかな。まだわからねえ。それより Together, Hesuke and I covertly kept up, kept in close step with the Gang of Furies, leaving the compounds. Okay, creepy music is gone. After ten minutes, we'd reached a stop when... <coughs> oh. A blood-curdling scream shrieked in the distance, followed by the grisly sound of flesh being split open. Oh no. It meant... I sprinted after Heisuke, who burst into a run. By the time we arrived at the scene, it was too late. A, a lurid scattering of ripped flesh and limbs were sprawled across the blood-soaked street. <laughs> <laughs> Two ghastly furies, clad in white hair and a thick coat of blood, sadistically stabbed into the bodies of corpses lying helplessly along the straight, the stained pathway. With each horrific jab of their swords came the repulsive splatter of blood upon their mad faces. Despite Hijikata-san's Hijikata warning that the victims were often left disfigured beyond recognition, one thing was clear. They were not soldiers. They were ordinary people. I watched Heisuke's right fist tremble fiercely. I couldn't blame him. It was difficult to see his comrades resort to such abject depravity, becoming murderers to satiate their never-ending thirst for human blood. <laughs> I'm surprised they're not in uniform, like proper Western uniform. One of the Furies turned to face Heisuke, and his bloodstained lips curled into a warped smirk. Madness, it seemed, had consumed them, leaving no trace of sanity behind their red glowing eyes. All that remained was a, pri was a primal urge, festering within them to kill and drink the blood of their targets. <laughs> With shaking hands, Hiski unsheathed his sword, biting his lips nervously as he barked out at me. Chizuru! 
平助分かったな平助の bark was fast approaching a bite and I made myself hidden as he ordered me to but would he really be okay? Could he take on two of the fury corpse by himself? Men that up until today had eaten, slept and served alongside him nobly but as his allies? <laughs> One of the Furies broke into a, ma a maniacal cackle. Then he leapt from the ground and lunged for Heisuke's throat. <laughs> Heisuke nimbly evaded the Furies' strike, watching the path of its movements with relaxed ease. The Fury turned on its heel and slipped a little, giving Heisuke the perfect opportunity to make his move. Heisuke kicked at the ground and thrust his sword into the Fury's sternum, producing a gush of blood. The Fury yelped in pain and took a step back. It seemed Heisuke's blade hadn't pierced through any of its vital organs, so it still had the chance to heal. Before Heisuke could catch its breath, <laughs> The other Fury, who had been waiting. Really on? The other Fury, who had been waiting for the opportune moment to pounce, charged at Heisuke. Heisuke swung his sword to parry the incoming attack, but he hadn't caught it fast enough. The blade cut his shoulder, tearing a wide cut into his flesh that spewed a stream of blood into the air. Despite bleeding profusely from the wound in his shoulder, Heisuke threw wild slashes at the Fury. Just as Heisuke claimed, the blood trickling down his shoulder stopped, and it seemed the wound was beginning to seal itself. But should he really be using those powers? As Sun mentioned, each instance of healing had potentially sapped away his precious lifespan. To make matters worse. In spite of his best efforts, Heske struggled to land a vital blow on either of the Furies, swinging aimlessly at the, vi at the vicious pair. <laughs> I noticed the fatigue began to set in for Heisuke, which was only exacerba exacer exacerbated by how frequently his opponents seemed to be regenerating their wounds. Maybe, just maybe, just as it seemed the situation had turned dire. <laughs> the bitch is here and I don't know why! That voice! When my mind registered whom it could have belonged to, the sight of a white blade glimmering spectacularly in the moonlight shined before my eyes. At the spe as the spectacle faded, the bloodshed continued. Cries of despair echoed eerily, one after the other. Each fury dropped to the floor, pools of blood forming under their stiff, lifeless, lifeless bodies. There was no mistake. <coughs> Ugh. Few beings in this world were capable of subduing a pair of furies as effortlessly as was done here. Certainly not if they were human. Kozama! Amagiri! The bitch is back! I'm not happy about it. Edo Shichu no 
貴様ら新選組が勝っているでなぜ奴らが辻斬りを働いているのか貴様らの命令かそんな命令するわけねえだろ俺はあいつらを追ってきたんだよ Esther shouted back but Kazuma and Amagiri looked at him suspiciously. Edo no machi o sawagase te iru tsujigiri jiken wa Kino kyo hajimatta mono dewa nai to kii te imasu. Kisama wa shouchi shite oranu to shite mo Ano magai mono no tounoku. Tashi ka san nan to iu na da. Yatsu wa ko yatsu ra ga rozeki o hatarai te iru koto o shi te iru no de wa nai ka. Yase no onna oni ni menji te kisama ra ni te da shi wa se ne da. Shi ni kurutta magai mono o nobana shi ni shi te o kuko de ware ware wa kai no de wa. Five. あなた方はもともと今日の治安を守るという役目を仰せ使っていたはずです血を得るため江戸の人々を殺めることがあなた方の本意なのかどうか今一度考えてみてはあなた方はあなた方はあなた方はあなた方はあなた方はあなた方はあなた方は Hesuke stared bitterly at the ground as he sheathed his sword back into its scabbard. How's your shoulder doing, Hesuke? Kizuna, I hate it. I'm not sure what I'm doing. I'm not sure what I'm doing. I'm not sure what I'm doing. You mean the fact that Sun and Sun is aware that his furies are butchering innocent people? 実際どうかわからねえけど三男さんって頭は回る人だからな羅折隊のやつらが頓傷を抜け出して辻斬りを働いてたことに今まで気づかなかったはずだねえんだ Then... とりあえず頓傷に戻ったら本人に直接確かめてみよう素直に答えてくれるかどうかわからねえけどここに置いていくしかねえ。大服を着てねえから、町の人に新選組大使だってことを気づかれることはねえはずだ。Thank God I was having flashbacks to the first night in Kyo. So, in this moment, I recalled my first night in Kyo when I had been cornered by the group of Furies. Ichikata san and the rest of the Shinsugumi men spoke nonchalantly, despite standing above the hair raising display of corpses strewn across, across the alley. I gathered the impression that the Shinsungumi had grown accustomed to this kind of nauseating sight, especially as seasoned warriors, but. Heisuke was different. Heisuke was different, and it seemed like this grim reminder of mortality was enough to unsettle his already fatigued state of mind. Watching his lips curl into a frown made me worry that his well being was at risk. risk. There was something else too, I had wondered. No, Heske. I know that earlier Cosmo was just taunting you, but why did you hesitate before killing that fury? I was. I was just taunting you. Heske blush. Turning his gaze away from, from me, as if to prevent me from being able to read the truth in his eyes. So, I'm going to go to the house. 
Without another word, Heskis spun around and walked back in the direction of our headquarters. His actions did little to convince me that I was wrong. But we made our silent walk home together. As soon as we'd arrived at the compounds, Heske immediately briefed Sun and Son on the entire incident. なるほど。Heske's words were stern, making his point clear. Sanan-san's demeanor was cold and stoic. Whether his words were to be taken as truth, or if they were intentionally misleading, I would have had no way of knowing. With that, Son and Son stood and returned to his room. Gomakasarechimatana. <laughs> So, what are we going to do now? Luckily, the culprits behind those recent murders had already been dealt with, so if Sanan san was telling the truth, we should have nothing to worry about. Sanan san o toitsmeru to shitara, ii nogare dekinei o genba osaeru shika nei daro na. But is that something we could actually do? Wakara nei. とりあえず土方さんが戻ってくるまでは、三男さんから目を離さねえようにしようぜ。うん。分かった。さてと、もうすぐ夜も明けちまうし、そろそろ休むことにするか。さすがに眠くなってきちまった。うん。プリーズ